I'm at Friesenhahn Cave in Central Texas, home to over 10,000 prehistoric fossils. Aside from the La Brea Tar Pits in Los Angeles, this is one of the most Pleistocene fossil-rich sites in North America, and I'm trying to figure out how all of these bones got here. So I'm heading to the Vertebrate Paleontology Lab at the University of Texas in Austin. So I'm curious about the bones. Is there any indication of how these animals died? Yes, there are some marks on some of the bones that might give you some idea, maybe perhaps not how they exactly died, but what happened to them shortly after. Oh, really? And uh, you have things like this. Um, wow, look um, at that scratch yeah, mark. So the scratch marks and... So, so what forth. caused this? Do you see any evidence that humans were making marks on the bones or that humans were eating animals in that cave? No, this is not something huh. damaged by a person. We definitely have two very perfect parallel grooves right. that are V-shaped in cross-section, and they probably match quite well with um, the actual uh, teeth from some kind of predator. That is a big These skull. Are, that is the skull of a homotherium, and uh, <clears throat> it's a pretty good-sized cat. Homotherium were large, prehistoric, saber-toothed cats, approximately the size of the modern African lion. They were apex predators and roamed vast areas of North and South America, Eurasia, and Africa before going extinct. Ernie tells me that not just one, but 13 adult Homotherium skeletons have been found in Friesenhahn Cave, alongside five juveniles. So this could have been a den? I think so. Is it plausible that this saber-toothed cat pulled in all of the prey? I mean, that's a huge diversity of prey for one animal. Probably others were contributing as well because there are other animals in there. So based on the evidence I've seen, flooding could be a factor in depositing the fossils here. If not one massive flood, then at least smaller, more regular events as water travels down through the cave to the aquifer. But more than likely, giant homotherium cats brought the bulk of the bones into the cavern. Technology has helped us unlock the ancient mystery of Friesenhahn Cave, a repository of Ice Age fossils like no other, and a testament to the wild ferocity of prehistoric times. <laughs>